Okay, March 1st, 2023, gonna do a real quick one today, and I'm gonna share my screen to let you know what I'm referring to that I'd like to talk about. And I'm going back to the 12 steps of happiness, and today I wanna to talk about two of them at a time. It'll be very quickly, I just wanna share a bit of the success story here that I'm kind of proud of. And strength training, number two, strength training simply, briefly, intensely one to three times a week uh and then the next one is if not an ideal body composition form habit of a slight caloric deficit so strength training i talk about a lot that's what i do i'm an exercise instructor helping people to get stronger in the less least amount of time and the safest way possible and i believe that's one of the most important things you can do the other thing is when it comes to body composition, I have a client I want to talk to you about. His first name is Don. Don is 80 years old. And Don is meticulous. He refers to himself as being a little anal, if you will. And I believe when it comes to body composition, you have to do that. And Don has been training with me now for 195 days, so a little bit over six months. And I just want to share, I'm going to switch my share here to let's see a new share and i want to go to photos i can find it uh okay i'm going to actually stop share all together let's see if i can do this i'm sharing desktop one back to that and now what I want to do is bring that photos. All right, so I'm going to make sure I'm going to stop sharing. You might be seeing that now, but I'll make sure you're seeing the right thing. So here we go. So this is uh, the result of Don's uh, progress with me over the last 195 days. Now, Don watches his calories, uh, he counts it, he counts his protein, and he's trying to get him to have more protein. He's still not up to where I think he should be, uh, but he comes in regularly. He only comes in once a week on the last 195 days. As a matter of fact, this reading here, he had a little bit of an illness, and he missed, uh, he hadn't been here today as March 1st. He hadn't worked out since February 8th, and he had one of his uh, best workouts ever. So I just want to point out here. Uh, so in the change of 195 days, his weight's gone down 7.4 pounds and his body fat change has gone down 6.7 percentage points. But that that's all good. But the real neat thing here is he's done that while gaining 4.6 pounds of muscle mass. His muscle mass, and for those people who might be seeing um, this and say that number is high. It's not skeletal muscle mass. This includes smooth muscle, this and organs and things like that. But he's gained 4.6 pounds of muscle mass. If you want to look at it another way here, same thing here, 4.6 pounds of uh, fat-free body weight, which kind of is another way of saying the same thing. His protein is up. Uh, and here is, it says from 21.8 body fat to 15.1. Remember, this is a 80 year old man. Uh, he was not unfit when he came to see me. Uh, he has always been very active, but a lifelong jogger, and surprisingly to me, but he has been careful. He's aware of the pitfalls of jogging and how it can be hard on the body, and he's always tried to keep his mileage down low and really spent a lot of time working on technique. So a little bit of hip issues, but considering he's 80, he's done uh, quite well. And what I'm trying to do here is see the number of pounds of fat that he's actually lost. So I guess this one doesn't show it in pounds. It shows it in percentage. But if you do the math, if you weigh 158.6, I have the calculator here, 158.6 times um, 21.8% body fat. 
means you're carrying about three, four and a half pounds of fat. And then if you go over here, you go 151.2 times 15.1% uh, body fat. That's 22.83. So that's, he's washed just over 12 pounds of fat and put on four pounds of muscle, an 80 year old man. And you know, this is not my typical client on um, the full disclosure, uh, but the main difference between him and other clients is how meticulous he's been with diet. So diet does make a huge difference. Anyways, all for now, having a really busy day, so we're gonna cut this show. Bye for now.